Hello everybody, my name is Angelo and I'm a filmmaker from Italy and uh, if you are here it's maybe because you want to learn how I made this uh, hyperlapse uh, in uh, Tokyo between uh, Shibuya Crossing and if you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, I'm talking about this video. So if you've ever been there, you know how busy is this place and I wanted to film the moment where all the people cross the street in the same time because they have different parts where you can cross. I saw that there is no a, a, a moment of the day where you have less people. It's, it's always busy during the day, but even if it's night, there are still a lot of people over there. So I wanted to make something to mix uh, the two moments of the day and make this unique video. So if you want to know how I film the hyperlapse, well, I film everything on this little camera, which is the DJI Osmo Pocket. It's uh, one of the best camera I ever had in my life because uh, this camera is uh, uh, 4K 60 frames and uh, it's a lot if you think that you have to post uh, these videos on the social media, so it's more than enough and it's really easy to use I mean you just have to press this button and it turns on automatically but to film the hyperlapse I always prefer to use the phone so once you connect the uh, phone on your camera the app automatically show up okay we don't have SD card but we don't need okay first of all we need to select hyperlapse mode then we need to choose uh, the speed of our hyperlapse but uh, I think 5 is okay after that let's go into settings pro mode you have to select scene like because you want more dynamic range while you're shooting after that we need to set the white balance you can leave automatic or sunny if uh, it's a sunny day or cloudy but if you want to have a fixed white balance just uh, select custom and set uh, how you want the tones more cool or more warm but how i film this uh, first of all uh, I was crossing the street and I saw that there were a big LED screen on my left so I said okay maybe I can focus on this and walk through the street and follow this big LED screen so if you don't know you can track stuff around uh, around you while you are filming so I just put the auto track on the screen and, and once I was walking through the street the camera automatically turn and follow the, the LED screen so it's pretty easy to be honest so I made this video two times one during the day and the same video exactly the same during the night okay let's jump now into the editing you want to make a new project uh, call whatever you want uh, and uh, these are my settings because I'm filming in PAL, so 25 frames per second. Once the project is ready, let's go to select your clip. So one is this one, the day one, and the other one is this one. So now we just have to cut the part of the video that we don't need. And we have to make the same process for the day video and the night video. Once everything is done, we have to select the night clip and change the opacity so you can see through the clip. So now you have to overlap the two clips and put them in the same position. So just change the scale and the position on the screen. So this is a bit boring, so let's speed up this part. Once you finish the video is pretty much done but uh, we want to add uh, something else we want to add this cross dissolve transition to make the transition between day and night more smooth and once this part is done just copy and place the clip and reverse the second one and finally the video is done and you will get this video Okay. 
Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any question, of course, leave a comment below and don't forget to follow me, share this video, put a like, uh, you know, all this stuff. See you in the next video.